I nearly killed myself at 16 because I kicked out of school and my neighbor intervened unconsciously. I had a bunch of pills in my pocket and I was holding them and I jumped over her fence. I thought I'll just down these pills. And she saw me and she goes, how's your day going? I'm like, it, it sucks. And I, I was holding the pills and she just hugged me and she goes, in 30 years from now, this won't matter. You're going to be okay. And she gave me a real hug. and No one had really hugged me and loved me like that. We still speak today. She's like a 75, 80-year-old woman. Her name's Judy Turner. She's my neighbor. We still speak all the time. I said, do you remember that day? She goes, yeah, of course. I said, I wanted to kill myself that day. She goes, I don't know what you were doing. I just knew you were going to be okay. And look at you now. That's all she did. And you know what I do? That's all I try to do. Try and drop a little dose of positivity on every person. Give them a little hope. Tell them it's going to be okay. Because I've been there. Give them a hug. Smile at them. There, there, I want to say something you said there. When you just One thing you said there is, I mean, no one's going to care. And there's a lot of kids in this world right now. A lot of kids that are going through a lot of depression, stress, anxiety in high school and grade school. And they're not, they, they almost don't find a way out. And they feel like there's that battle. And it's like, you'd almost wish you could sit down with them and just have this open conversation and say that like, none of this peer pressure, none of this bullying, none of this shit, none of these assholes in high school are going to matter in fucking 20 years, even 10 years. Nope.